Hey guys, so we always have those kind of games that are here and there, right? The games that are very unwell made, like the GUIs are all over the place and you have no clue how to play the game, like you have store, score, or top players, right? And then you always have that one time where, well, there's actually just these few games, right? You go onto it, and there's a run GUI, right, at the top corner. But guess where that run GUI is? It's right where the chat is, you can't even click it. Right? And then you have character, or whatever else, in the other corner, and you only have, like, this small space to even do anything. And the worst part is, is you know those little, you know those new players, right? The, the newest players, or actually all players, they always have this little help button at the corner. Nobody's gonna notice that, but most of them, all games do that. And they're most likely on the right corner, or on the left side. What? No! ...side in the center, and nobody ever pays attention there, right? Now to fix this problem, it's pretty simple. See, if you're gonna put a run button, right? Move it down just a couple of inches, so like, your chat's not in the way, right? And if you're gonna put a help button, at least make it the size as store score or top players. Just to make it noticeable, right? Or a tutorial button. Okay, other than that, like, most games are so confusing. Like, you go into the game, and you have no clue what to do. There's no help button, and there's no timer, and then you just get popped into this new round. Because there's a little timer coming down, right? And you're about to play the game, and then boom, you have nothing, you have you have no clue what's going on whatsoever. You're trying to play the game, and then you're dead. Like, you don't even know what just happened. It doesn't tell you what, what round you're gonna do, nor does it tell you how to do this round and what you have to watch out for. And here's a little example of what I'm talking about. As you can see, I'm just getting ready, right? Like, the first time I played this, I had no clue what to do, right? But I, I did win the first round, and that's because I got a hang of it after a couple seconds. But then this giant boulder comes down in this game, right? I didn't even know where it came from. How would I know that it's coming down? I don't have- I shouldn't have to look up know what's happening this boulder should never have came down nor or at least it should give me a warning that I'm gonna get hit by a boulder so I know what I'm doing this is a horrible game other than that guys I hope you enjoyed the video like and comment that's if you have a comment to say and see you guys next week goodbye